Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of this friendly. Today it's Liverpool against Chelsea. Let's head to Anfield now. Marvellous day in the northwest, clear blue skies and the sun is shining brightly. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Martin Tyler here with Alan Smith. Hello to you all and welcome to today's game. Chelsea playing Liverpool with the great history of the fixture and some wonderful games in recent seasons as well between the two and they've both been going for league titles. And the ghost goal at Anfield. Plenty of history between these two teams. This is the Liverpool side. Simon Mignolet starts in goal. Martin Skirtle starts alongside Mamadou Sacco in the heart of the defence. Coutinho starts with Steven Gerrard in central midfield. Raheem Sterling starts up front with Daniel Sturridge. Here's the Chelsea lineup. Petacek starts in goal. John Terry plays with Gary Cahill in central defence. Fabregas plays with Nemanja Matic in central midfield. Diego Costa is the lone striker today. Brandon Rogers recognised at the end of the 13-14 uh, season by his fellow managers as the manager of the year, although he didn't have any silverware to show for it as a team. No, he didn't, and uh, he and the players, of course, really disappointed with that, but they've made a big step. Defenders will thank him for that. Skirtle! That's offside. The three has stopped the play as soon as the flag went up. On again. Says Fabregas. Whipped out wide. Good ball to stretch the opposition. Chelsea continuing to operate at the very highest level, the European Super Club now. Um, and no reason why they can't continue the success on them. No, I don't think so. As long as Roman Abramovich is around, they've obviously got a very wealthy backer and, and they have established themselves now. They've obviously got to live within their means with the financial fair play and what have you, but uh, they've assembled a, a very strong squad. And that will be a goal kick. Coutinho. work from the keeper keeping the ball moving that's important got to be and that's in the back of the net and it's there for Liverpool a goal from Coutinho oh and his teammates are doing 
delighted, and why not? Because he's just kept his composure outside the box to side with home. That's a goal well worth analysing again. Too much uh, criticism because the expectations weren't too high, and players like Daniel Sturridge are regarded as a good bet for a better future. In with a chance, it's a brilliant stop. Now they've got a corner on the attack again, the team that's leading by one goal. Save. Can't get it away. Corner again. Well done, powerful header. Steven Gerrard. Steven Gerrard had a couple of really big disappointments in 2014. In Liverpool not quite making it to win the. Premier League title and of course in the World Cup England not winning a game and going out at the group stage in quickly oh he's through he's in the clear here's the chance and it's a goal the goal from Sturridge and what about that Stroked it home, bottom left. Another angle on it here. possession he might be through judge the header to find uh, his teammate that could be a booking here well let's take another look at Sturridge's goal well, that's wonderful, isn't it? Because uh, he had an awful lot of work to do to beat the keeper from that distance. Adam Milano. Eden Hazard. And then he went, just diverted it away. He's made the save. Referee is pointed for a corner for Liverpool.
Coutinho. And there goes the whistle for half time. And the scoreline is 2 0. So we reach half time. 2 0 the score with Liverpool leading. Let's take a look back at the highlights from that first half and then we'll be back over to your commentary team for the second half. Can Liverpool replicate a good first half in the second period which is now underway? Now Fabregas. Now he'll get it back again. Cesc Fabregas. Oscar. He's being challenged now. Adam Lallana. And he can keep the attack going on the right side. The defenders come in well here. Timed his uh, approach and got the ball. Diego Costa. And here's the shot. Well, the target was there. Maybe he was looking at the target and not the ball because he didn't hit it really right in the middle. Yeah, There's an element of that. Just didn't keep his head down, his eye on the ball, and it's cost him. Skirtle. Played to Glenn Johnson. Went the flag, offside given, free kick. Steven Gerrard. That's Substitute getting ready for Chelsea. Diego Costa. Here's the chance. Adam Lallana. And that is a super interception. It. And that little deflection has sent the ball over the touchline. Well, now they're behind, they've got to try and switch things around, and here comes a substitution. I'll never be afraid to shoot, but they'll be hoping for better efforts than that. You want to have another look at that one, Alan, I guess. Well, you've got to admire that, that is wonderful. Change for Chelsea here. That's quick-witted play, but quick movement as well to avoid the slide tackle. Chelsea running out of chances now. Well, those defenders are going to be asked to head the ball. Quite a lot, I think. Plenty of aerial balls are going to be coming their way in the next few moments. It's a quick break. an open goal but he had to keep his concentration and he did the simple thing well another angle on it here that's a good lead three goals to nil Diego Costa 
before the tournament started. It looks as though Diego Costa was going to give Spain a different element to their team, maybe to improve them even more. Well, it could be it. Ben takes the shot off. Well, the keeper got a touch to it to make the save. Yet another corner. It's interesting the corner count to this point. And the corner has been kept out here by the goalkeeper. He's being challenged now. Three minutes. That's all that's left now. What we're looking at here is a manager thinking can't be so vulnerable in a wide area. He's going to change uh, one of the fullbacks now and hopefully uh, secure the game a bit more. It's almost like the opposing manager earmarked this player as a weakling. And that's the way it's turned out. And the referee has communicated to the fourth official to be five added minutes. Oh, he's through. What a chance now. Here's the shot. Off the line. Well, that's all they can do at the moment, concede the corners. header is a strong one and they clear the lines and that's it last blast on the whistle from the referee Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming. the other team have been put out of their misery here because they were very much off the pace today in a one-sided contest and that's totally humiliating wasn't it i'm sure they're willing for the ref to blow the final whistle